A right, a right, a right. How are you? Ooh. There's no time to stall. We must be on our way. Oh, sorry for that. Then let us go. Good, great. So we have to continue our quest to save Lyria. Lydia. Laria. Now that the catalyst is ours, it's just a matter of time before we get our Lyria back. Lyria. With the catalyst in our hands, we board the Grand Cipher to go after Avia again. Next stop is Fondum. Just a short hop step and a flight away. It's been roped off as a danger zone, which, yeah, isn't ominous at all. The church is headed there for one thing. Yet another altar housing a primeval god. All of Zega Grande's gods, or I guess primal beasts, are a force to reckon with. But we can't let Avia keep exploiting Lyria's power. If they force her to commit atrocities, once this is all over, she'll never forgive herself. Do you think this is the last? No, it's not. We still have one on the middle, top middle. So we are safe for now. The X Catalyst Stone. So do you think this stone will work? I have my doubts, but let's see. Chapter 7 already. Warning signs. Thick black smoke blankets the sky. Rivers of fire flow below. Yeah, pretty much the perfect stage for a fateful showdown. Well, here's to hoping we make it out in one piece. There, we're moored. Red ships shouldn't see us from here. We'll hit them before they know what's coming. I'm not the only one who saw that big-ass fire geyser, right? No, we all saw it. Only a primal could pull that off. Then it's clear that's where they've taken Lyria. Prepare for take... <laughs> what now? I believe it means the volcano is close to erupting. How are you so calm? Lava is not how I want to go out. And what about the Grand Cipher? But we have to get to Lyria. You're preaching to the choir. Of course I want to go rescue her, but I just... Ugh. I saw how they handled Excavalion. They could be my best bet going forward. But we'll be stranded here if we lose the ship. It would all be for nothing. Hmm, he's plotting something. Alright. I'll take the helm and fly the ship to safety. Once the area stabilizes, I'll come back to pick you guys up. You all go on ahead. Sorry for the trouble, Roland. Sure you don't mind? Not at all. Besides, since when has Mr. Fixit ever let you down? Ah, before I go. Vern, do you mind showing me the catalyst? Wait, right now? Um, sure. No problem. There. I've activated it. Hold it near Lyria, and it should release the lock on the collar. And that'll give us a fighting chance! Thanks, fix it, dude! Hmm... Time to part ways for now. Danger lurks around every corner in this place, so proceed with caution. Don't worry about us. You just focus on keeping the Grand Cipher safe. Come on, everyone. We need to hurry. I'm sorry, Skyfarers. Lilith was my responsibility. <sighs> Bastard, what did you do? You betrayed us. You'll share some apples when you come home, Lyria. Here he goes. The traitor! What have you done? Do you Don't think he deactivated the, the magic item that we got? Hmm. So, let me see if we can find some pincers in this map because we cannot return to them, apparently. At least I don't know how to. So that's magma, huh? Makes the desert feel downright frosty. Fall in and it's goodbye world. No one survived in that. Hey, you guys notice anything different about Roland? Not really. I mean, I guess he seems kind of tired. 
He's helped us out of more jams than I can count. Let's get him something nice once this is over. So she noticed it too, as well. <laughs> oh, he knows Lilith. Ooh. Do you think he was part of the same crew as her? Stop moving around, you damn camera! Oh uh, my god, this is so hard. Do you see that? Let's check it out! I see that, but I don't see any pincer. Hmm. <gasps> oh, we can go there. So we have one here. Oh, here. That's one. Is the last one? I don't believe so. So, oh, we have a chest there. You know, no crabs. Oh, a crab. Oh. Okay. I lost. Just needed a few more seconds. No, a few more minutes. Um. Let me just go there and grab... Where were we? Aha! Here! Whee! Nice. Oh yeah! And the chest was... This <laughs> way! What's this? Booyah! Neat. Colossal Cane Omega! Who is this? For Eo? Okay! You has a nice... No, not a nice weapon. A new weapon. Oh! Slime! Oh, it is! Decimate! Where are you? Overdrive guys? Watch your step. Uh, now you arrive. Oh, Teamwork! Oh, oh, yeah! You were spectacular, Captain. Thanks a bunch, Fairy. Fairy? Oh, that's uh, how you say her What's name, this? Barry. The camera is uh, pointing automatically. <laughs> Let's do this! So annoying. We have to fall. Fall, fall, fall. Catch this one. Jump. Uh, jump again. Uh, jump again. Jump again. Did we manage to do it? <laughs> oh, yes. Woohoo! Uh, it's not easy as pie, maybe nice easy as an apple. <laughs> I don't know. Ooh, Amina's entrance. What's this? Neat. Neat. And go. I was thinking, oh, maybe I should use I can my. I feel it. A primal beast is mastery nearby. points. My mastery points. But. Let's go. Uh oh. Eo, no. Uh, eel. Eel? Uh -huh. I spy a jerk thing. <laughs> Stay back! He fighting that primal beast. Your guess is as good as mine. All I know is he's the reason Lyria's here in the first place. It's messy. Why do we have to kill? Crap, crap, volcano's getting ready to blow. Oh no! The ground is sinking into the magma! Can't do anything about it! Just run for your lives! Don't look back! I'm going, I'm going!
Oh, something's here. Got it. Uh oh. Uh, I'm dead. No, I'm dead. Bollocks. I can try. Here we go. And I didn't find any pieces. So. Your guess is as good as mine. All I know is he's the reason Lyria's here in the first place. Crap, crap, crap. Volcano's getting ready to blow. Oh no! The ground is sinking into the magma! Can't do anything about it! Just run for your lives and don't look back! Die, so we finally caught up. Stay out of this. That chance, you know, we're the thorn in your side that won't come out. I'm on my way, Lyria. This catalyst is gonna fix you right up. Wait, Burn. Don't go rushing in. If the catalyst gets broken, we'll lose everything. We need to stop it from crashing around. We'll tell you when it's your turn. Uh, are you okay? All right. Nice Miserable mist! Right! Suffer! It's time. Work together and we'll make it through! How's this? So massive that I How's can only this? attack his so so. <laughs> I have a question for you. Why has that primal beast imprisoned Lyria? Since you're fighting it, I'm going to assume it wasn't acting on church orders. This has nothing to do with you, you little punk. If anything happens to her. Volcano isn't gonna blow anytime soon, right? That primal looks quite similar to Bahamut. Is that why it was able to imprison Lyria? Why is it taking a dip in the magma? Oh, the yikes! It's a magma wave! Uh -oh. Get swallowed by that, and it'll eat more than a nasty burn! Get to the cover of that outcropping! It's our only chance! I'm going, I'm going! Now's our chance to close the gap! Oh, I was too far away to get hit. Nice. <laughs> oh, see? He, he cut the wave in half? I don't know whether to be grateful or terrified. Oh, both, I guess. That's our cue! Keep it up, guys! I'm missing Why all the action. Going that far? Could he really be trying to save Lyria? I mean, even if he does. He'll just take her away again, and we're back to square one. My thoughts exactly. Can't let him do that. It looks like they've come to an impasse. Now we can join the fight. Another wave is coming. Ah. Uh... Oh. Do <laughs> <laughs> I have to wait here, right? Yes. Now go. Oh, another one. Can we go now? Oh, so we have to run from one place to the other. Oh, you missed! Thank you! Help is on the way! Be careful, Vayne. You got it! You have to wait for the certain point. Thanks! You can run, but you can't hide! Not why we're on the hunt! Hold on, Lyria! Why are you here? Do you even care about her? I already told you it has nothing to do with you. I have. Slashing back! Yet yeah, we got this! Attack! 
Cagliostro, you're the best. Thanks, Captain Obvious. <laughs> Thanks, Captain Obvious. Where's this light coming from? It's delirious. I, I believe it's some kind of natural defense mechanism. What do we do now? Our attacks are getting through it all. That's the primeval god of dread for Let's catch you up. There's no control in it. I see what happened now. Avia yeah. brought Lyria to this altar and awakened the primal beast. God, as a manifestation of dread, it turned right around and did what you feared most. It abducted Lyria. Is that the gist of it? Hey! We might not be able to get through to the giant thing, but I know someone who can. Of course, the catalyst. We'll create an opening so you can wake Lyria up. Get ready, Vern. Wait for us to attack all at once. We will pass the torch. I'm going, Fred. Just give me the signal. Now, Vern! Here goes nothing. Come on, Lyria. Wake up! Uh. Smash through the wall like it was nothing. It's like another chase is afoot. It's running scared because it knows the catalyst worked. Our next encounter will be its last. You know it. I'm going to give Lyria the wake-up call of her life. Okay, but first we save. Let's see. Wait. How'd they get down there? At least this time we found one crab. Better than nothing. We just jump? Yes. Okay. Ah. What the? What's going on here? I call a temporary truce. Okay. Do you realize how preposterous that sounds coming from you? Blue light from the lizard. It's safe, Miriam. So what? You gotta rip it from our cold, dead hands? You'd have to team up with that primal beast to even stand a chance against us! Primal beast? Is that what you call primeval gods? I still don't fully trust him, but I do believe he's telling the truth about wanting to save Lyria. Avia needs Lyria to control primal. She's the crux of their plan. But as long as she's trapped inside that crystal, both she and the church are at an impact. Does that sound about right? Yeah. And let's face it. If you want to take down this god, you'll need my help. All right. We'll work with you for as long as our goals align. I still don't like the idea of teaming up with this leader. Beggars can't be choosers. Uh, <laughs> Ready to deliver, Tempest Flame! Let's deliver. Fairy! On it! Shine as one! Absolute zero! Oh, that was a nice combo. Almost there! That, that does make sense. Because we are fighting. Thank you. Yeah. I'll analyze their attack pattern and come up with a sufficient strategy. Uh oh, he's mad. Means our attacks won't get through. Vern, let's do what we did before. After we create an opening, you use the catalyst. Good. I'll be ready. Here comes the magma. Get to the side. Seriously? That's like trying to avoid water in a bathtub. Let's heal you up. <gasps> oh, I got it. Why? It's not fair. Uh oh. Run. Oh, ouch. I cannot heal. I needed that. Thank you. Let's catch you up. Be like now, these. Burn. Can you hear us, Lyria? Come back! Darn it! Not again! Decimate. I think it's working, though! Our light around the primal is gone! Now to infuse. 
inflict pain. Breaks like glass. I think you just found a sweet spot. What's this? Stay alert. Something's brewing. What now? Does it plan on unleashing that ball of fire? You mean like taking us all out in a blaze of glory? But look, its movements have slowed. We still have a chance to stop. So we have to kill these magma. Now where are we gonna steer? Did that manage to stop it? Man is still flowing out of other parts of its body. We should split up to save time. Oh, I see. I'm going to that one then. Go, 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 go. I'll help you, Cagliostro. Only one left. And it's Miserable this mist. One. <laughs> the last one. The ball of fire dissipated. Catastrophe averted. Muhammad, save me. We barely stopped that ticking time bomb. Panacea. I owe you. The fire has regenerated. Everyone, you know the drill. This is a job for fun. Here we go, Burn. We're gonna stun this brute. Gotcha. Standing by. Can I attack it from here? Now, Burn. One more time. Go, Vern, you can do it! Save our friend! No, Vern, Dutch! Go! I know already! Take this! No! It's working! Keep at it! Wait for the thing! You're forgiven for that time you socked me. This fight is almost over. We can't make a mistake. That goes double for you, Captain. If we lose you, we lose Lyria too. Let's patch you up. Our captain here shares a life link with Lyria. Their fates are connected. Their lives are linked. Don't die. This'll show them. Now. Let's, Let's take go. it home! Let's Get in there and do some damage! Oh, you the deserve head. the credit! That's why she gave a no-kill order for you, Captain. And for Lyria to be truly happy. Having second thoughts? Maybe there's hope for you after all. It's coming out of its days, but I'm certain we're wearing it down. Help me. Please. Are you feeling okay? That was a close now one. I am. So, mother, what? I couldn't breathe. I was distracted by dying. Sweet. What did he say? Decimate. I don't have it. No fairy. Yeah. Don't throw in the towel, you guys. I'm exhausted too, but we're almost there. We've overcome so much. Oh yeah, my turn. The chamber will not be our tomb. Shine is one. The astrophism. The astrophism. Miserable mist. Uh -oh. This is it, huh? The point of no return. It's us or the primate. Oh. Uh, run. Oh, come on, really? Maybe the wave won't hit you if you escape to the side. I tried. <laughs> Vain, don't die, please. Okay, we'll use a, a potion. Here we 
everything is burning. Ouch. This will show him. Right. It's suffer. Playtime's not over yet. Understood. Thanks. Get your head out of the clouds, kids. Don't you want to save Lyria? Feeling conflicted? Seems you're actually soft under that storm. Oh, no. oh, no. Stay with us. Fairy, please. Be careful, Fairy. I can still fight. Okay. I won't give in. I'm dying a lot in this fight. Take this. Oh. Now it's our time to kill him. 4%! Go, 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 go! Slash it back! Bring it on him! Enter action! Let's go! Come on, Jack! Alright, here we go! Feel? The moment of truth! Finish it, Vern! Leave it to me! He's going to... Vomit lava? Another way! Okay, we are safe in this one. Run! No, I will stay here. Now he's going to run to the lava again. I really like when Cagliostro said, Dumbass! Oh, I killed him. Oopsie. No <laughs> no Let's go! Well done, everyone. Where did you come from? Huh? You can't do that. Give her back to us. It. What a pity. Grief and misery make fools of us all. Here I see a troop of puppets, flouncing about in a play with no audience. And your bond with the shaman? It's threadbare. Little more than a thin line of hope. Fear not. Entrust me with your strings, and I shall deliver salvation unto you all. I know this is much too sudden for you to comprehend. But don't struggle. Embrace it. Pitiful fools! Face your judgment! How nice of Avia's leader so to come to meet us herself. Saved us the trouble of tracking you down. My dear, I'm not looking for a fight. Decimate. I've come to extol the virtue of salvation. Miserable mist! I was not expecting to fight her. Oh, the magic tricks and no, I know. Screaming <laughs> with power. I'm afraid to even get close to her. Such loss, little lad. Such unbelievable mana. And what's that black aura nice coming off here. of her? Uh, Panacea. 
The ordeals of our pilgrimage are nearly go, 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 go. at an end. Your crew is largely to thank for that. Acknowledge my vision, and salvation shall come. Isn't it obvious that I am shepherding all to a transcendent future? We don't need your phony baloney philosophy. As skyfarers, we put our faith in a free sky. This is penance. Ha! The jit. Very well. The time has come to pen a new chapter in this saga. Oh, yes. yes. Of calamity. Ah. Good. Uh. This has been a long journey, but a fruitful one. Now, to open the gates and bask in the light of paradise. Let's catch you up. Stop. What are you doing? No, we'll all be. Why must you reject salvation? Do you not see that it is the perfect course? You dare defy me to the end? I'd rather not harm you. That would not be in the shaman's best interest. So I ask, judge for yourself the miracle of my salvation. Ah! Huh? That's dirty! Give it back! Why? This has always belonged to us. I admit, I am intrigued as to how you were able to activate the Catalyst. Although, I suppose it no longer matters at this point. With the Primals in my possession, I've won. She knows how to make a strong cage. My powers are useless against it. Damn it! We didn't come this far to get put in timeout! There is still hope left. Roland? You did this? Of course he did. Is he a primal? And now even Vulcan Bola has fallen into Lilith's hands. I can't stall any longer. The fate of the skies calls upon the might of your crew. Will you fight to save it? Roland, I'm not sure if I like where this is going. Yeah. Tell us what this is all about. Of course. But first, your injuries need tending to. Let's return to the ship. <sighs> the time to reveal the truth has come. Oh boy. Here we go. Let's speak with him and find out what, why he knows Lilith. And why he's she, his burden. Well, the floor is all yours, Roland. Thanks. First, I want you all to take a look at this. That's the beast from Tempeel. Furican. Lilith released the primal beasts from their slumber and stole their powers. Those powers now flow within Lyria. She's essentially a living storage vessel. <laughs> the Astral Realm is Lilith's home. One way back is to restore the Forbidden Primal. 
Angra Mainyo. I hope I'm wrong, but she plans to feed it the other beast's powers. Just how big and nasty is this Mainyu thing? It's the primal beast of gateways, allowing all kinds of travel between any two points. Distance doesn't matter, so in theory, one could even pass through to the Astral Realm. It doesn't sound that evil to me if all it does is open a bunch of doors. <sighs> if only it were that innocent. The problem lies in what's needed to open a gate. You see, the gates require energy proportional to the distance between them. Now, let's pretend we want to open a gate to the Astral Realm. In this case, distance is secondary. Now we're discussing interdimensional travel. So, energy-wise... Yes. An extraordinary amount will need to be consumed. And that instantaneous consumption will trigger grave repercussions. At best, Zega Grande would be reduced to nothing in the aftershock. At worst, most of the Sky Realm would cease to exist as we know it. There's no way that's possible! Then let me tell you a story. Fifteen years ago, Lilith revived Angra Mainyu. She attempted to open the gate to the Astral Realm. Fortunately, for whatever reason, she failed in her scheme. But a number of islands weren't so lucky, and they were rendered uninhabitable. Survivors of the incident are forever cursed to live their lives with unending trauma. That's awful. You see now? She won't give up. She will utilize the power of the Four Primals and attempt to cast open the gates once more. And the only thing waiting for us on the other side of those gates is sheer destruction. We can't allow history to repeat itself. There's something I'd like to ask about this woman, this Lilith. She's an astral, isn't she? The potency of her powers and her obsession with the astral realm give her away. <sighs> the astrals. The invaders who once ruled over our skies. Oh, so... They are from other... Other what? They are from other dimensions. Interesting. You are correct. Mm-hmm. Well, it takes one to know one. <laughs> Unbelievable. I suspected as much a while back. You knew a great deal about this Skydom, things that no ordinary person should know. I'll be damned. A real live astral right under our noses. <laughs> Sorry, can't blame the guy for being on edge. Is that... Those are obvious raptors! You're kidding! They really chased after us? They couldn't have mobilized a hunting party this quickly. Of all the times to hound us, they choose now? Well, they're here! Less talking, more blasted! You heard Poygan? More blessing. Looking good. Magic is the next level. I had hoped for a more peaceful flight. How did they find this route? Let's do this. Stay formation. We must take this ship. They seem just as surprised as we are. It might be a coincidence. All squadrons shoot to kill. Lady Lilith has decreed these heathens be purged for their nefarious schemes! Unfortunate timing on our part. Stay alert for more. It just occurred to me. 
There's only one destination at the end of this flight path. Which means we're headed to the same place as these jokesters. Indeed. And let us discuss particulars after we have saved our hides. Super broke! We fight as one! We got this! It seems conviction it. is a strong motivator. Well, when you got an astral yanking your chain. Synergized and energized. Thank you. The next is level well, 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 fights as one. I'll stop you in your tracks. Now, you're so <laughs> You okay? I'm Just too intelligent to get hurt. <laughs> Go for broke! We fight as one! Booyah! Finally, that was the last of them. Looks like Obvious already making their next move. I must take action. Wait. I just want to be super sure. Are you really an astral? Oh, so we can check what they are. Yes, I forgot about this glossary. So what is an astral? Astral. <laughs> an astral. <laughs> Though the origins of astrals are yet a mystery, one thing is certain. They wield terrible power, defying even the laws of nature. They once subjugated the Sky Realm, forever changing the course of its history, but in a mirac miraculous reversal of fortune were defeated by Sky Dwellers in an insurrection known as the War. Though the physical presence of Astrals has all but faded into myth, their influence remains in the form of unique technology, some of which is still utilized in modern airships. Okay. You wouldn't be the first. We've met other astrals before. Loki and Mikaboshi, if those names ring a bell. They have their own particular philosophies. But you seem different from them. I know, right? It's like Fix a Dude actually wants to be a part of the Sky Realm. Indeed. It was no act when you risked life and limb to save the people of Folka and Tempil. I'll be honest. I once viewed Sky Dwellers as insignificant. But that all changed. Many years ago, the first friend I ever made in this world taught me a valuable lesson. They said there is strength in solidarity. Understanding can overcome adversity. Help us grow. Volka is now my home away from home. The people there are like family to me. Sadly, we experience longevity on different scales. If I were granted one wish, it'd be to stay with them forever. At the very least, I want them to be happy. I'll do anything I can as an astral to protect the populace. To protect the islands. And I'll stop Lilith. No matter the consequences I must suffer. We understand how you feel. The Sky Realm is our home too. So you can count on us. I guess even Astros come in all kinds of different flavors. Just like Sky Dwellers. The same can be said of primal beasts. Heh. <laughs> Kinda weird having an astral watching our backs for once. But I won't complain. Thanks, everyone. I'm sorry I haven't been up front with you all. I suppose I was acting out of cowardice. I was... afraid of your reactions, if you learned I was an astral. We're in this together. <laughs> Captain. Thank you. <laughs> done and done. Yes, 
With Roland's aid, we'll surely stop Lilith and rescue Lyria. Angramanyu's real body is in an altar beneath Seed Hollow Castle. Yikes. There's a sinister primal lurking right under that huge city? Yes. And I'm the one who sealed it down there centuries ago. But if Lilith found Angra 15 years ago, that means the seal is... Broken. When she squandered away Angra's power, she failed to capture its true form as well. I'm certain it's still in the altar somewhere, camouflaged by its gateway powers. Uh, so that's why you stayed behind in Sea Hollow, to find the damn thing. Indeed. Unfortunately, my search turned up nothing. However, the moment Lilith summons Angra's real body, that may be our chance to strike. I warn you, she and I are equally matched. But, lucky for me, I've got the better team. Abia's no doubt getting closer to the castle. There's no time to lose. We'll gear up in the city and make a run for the altar. Or else these skies are done for. Okay, so... Under the city. I must thank you everyone. Yes, you must. <laughs> awesome! And I must thank you as well. So, thank you for watching. And on the next journey, we will go back to the grand city. With full of flowers and markets. So... Yeah. That must be that massive gate that we couldn't open before, right? So, uh, the astros are from other place, right? So, the sky, sky them are islands that float. So, isn't there any land uh, beyond the sea of clouds under it? No? I'm curious to know. Sweet. So yes, I'm. I'm losing my focus. So next time we we'll, we will go places. <laughs> so thank you for watching and catch you on the next one. Bye.